with On Purpose Fitness, where we get fit on purpose and we move with purpose. Are you ready for another hit blast? Do you have six minutes in your day today? Yes, we all do. We can find six minutes anytime, especially when it means we're going to be shedding body fat. Why not? All right, we have two movements today. You have tuck jumps and crossing running woman. So it's not going to be easy. We will have modifications. We will warm you up and get you ready to go, okay? So let's warm up first by practicing some of our movements, okay? So instead of the tuck jumps, you can do high knees. So you can take these up with like some power, like you might with a tuck jump. Follow along with me, we're warming up. Or you're running high knees. So I can always run these instead of my tuck jumps. Or do as many tuck jumps as you can and then go to the high knees when you need to. Let's take these to butt kickers. Start moving your arms. Get your body moving, ready to do some work. So our sets today are going to be 30 seconds on with a 30 second recovery. That's a lot of recovery for you. So you're gonna go hard, hard on our 30 second work sets, okay? Because you know you're gonna get all that recovery time. All right, just give me a few more butt kickers. And we're gonna bring it down and practice our running woman. Sorry, let me adjust this a little bit. Okay, so bring it down. So regular running man, running woman, knees to the chest. Go ahead and do a few of these so we open up and warm up those hips. And then we're gonna start crossing that knee to the opposite elbow. So we can always keep this walking version or we're gonna run it when we get to our high intensity intervals. All right, give me four more crossing. And then go ahead and press yourself up into a down dog. Bring your hips back down into a plank. So go from that down dog, grab your, grab your hips up, grab them back down. Get a little bit of range of motion through the shoulders, the hips, lengthen those hamstrings. Stay up in your downward dog. And then step your feet to your hands, squat it down. Come on up out of a squat, and then bring it back down and up. All right, we're gonna get to our first round. Tuck jumps 30 seconds, rest 30 seconds. Crossing running woman, 30 seconds, rest 30 seconds. Are you ready? Yes? All right, let's see, tuck jumps. So you're bringing your knees up to your chest, all right, or power, well, you're not jumping. Here we go, 30 seconds, go. Round one, tuck jumps. Whew. So you do as many as you can. You can buff them out fast. You can take a little break. Do one, rest. It's your 30 seconds. Come on, let's do this. Oh. As many tuck jumps as you can do. Bring those knees up to your chest. You know you're gonna get 30 seconds of rest. You can be right here, giving some, some power High knees, Woo. good, good, 30 seconds of rest. rest. Woo. I'm always filming these after another hard workout where I just had to do 50 tuck jumps twice. So sorry for my huffing and puffing. Make your way down to the floor. You should be huffing and puffing because we are doing high intensity work. So we're getting ready for our crossing running moments. 30 seconds with a 30 second rest. Shoulders right over your wrists, body straight. Here we go, cross it. <laughs> run it, walk it, run some, walk some, whatever version you need to take. But we're going for high intensity, getting that heart rate up. <sighs> Whew. So if you need to walk some, you can always jump back into running. <sighs> Let's do it. Let's do it, come on. Keep those shoulders right over your wrist. Try not to hit land, hang out behind your arms. Booty down. Yeah, good job. Rest. All right, you ready for round two? Round two, we know what we're doing now. Whew. Nice 30 second recovery. Can be your dance break if you want. Can be your water break. You can walk around your room. Whew. See all this rest time is getting us ready for more work. All right, get ready for tuck jumps. Here we go, bring on the intensity. Knees up to your chest. You're going 
power, high knees like this, if you're not able to jump with us. Woo! Drop it low, put it in the dirt. Six drive, put it in reverse. 30 seconds, high intensity work. Let's do it. Land on the balls of your feet. Absorb in those hips. Uh, 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 that's rough. Red. Really hard. Uh, walk it off. Breathe. Open up your chest. Woo. Taking our 30 seconds of recovery so that we can come back into this crossing running man with all our intensity. 10 seconds. Take a couple deep breaths. Okay, set your body up in your solid plank. Crossing, running woman, go. Run it, walk it, you know what to do. Try to get that knee all the way to that arm. Using your obliques, turning your hips. Check in, that your butt is not sticking up in the air. Uh. Woo! Walk when you need to, bring it back to running. Make you my enemy. Not playing with your life. Rest. Woo. Oh man. We have one more round. One more. Can you feel that body fat just melting off right now? You can feel it happening, can't you? All right, getting that heart rate up, taking our recovery, bringing it back down, preparing to do one more round. One more round. You have it. You can do one more round. Tuck jumps or your modified tuck jump. Woo. Let's go. Come on, last time. Knees up to your chest. Try to get those abs involved. Man, soft on the balls of your feet. How many can you get done? Those are hard. Rest. But you can feel the intensity, right? Feel the heart rate. Whew. Up there. Okay, one final 30 second move. I know you can do this. I know we're all gonna fight through, not give in. That's not what we do here. We get fit on purpose. So we move on purpose. Let's do it. Get in your plank, cross those knees, let's go. Work. Last 30 seconds. Give a strong push to finish this out. Breathe. Run fast, run slow, walk strong, whatever you need. Uh, you know what you need. Five seconds. Yes. Bring it into your child's pose. Take a little Rest. breather. Stopping oh. Stretch your arms out, sit your hips back. Take a deep inhale. Exhale. Woo. Walk yourself up into that downward dog. Downward dog into your plank. Grab your hips with those abdominals. Pull the hips up, pull the hips back down. Woo. Nice work. One more time in your downward dog. Hips up, press those heels down. Press your head through your shoulders. Oh man, soften your knees. Walk or hop them toward your feet. Come on up. Oh, sorry, in your hips. <laughs> Take a deep breath in. Exhale. Woo. Oh my gosh, so you can feel your metabolism all revved up right now. It's on fire. Take this six minutes a couple times during the week. You can do another round again today if you want. That was just your warm up practice round. All right, so high intensity interval training, boosting your metabolism during the workout, after the workout. So give me these six minutes, two more times this week, okay? Can you try to challenge yourself to do this workout twice more? You saw how little that took, right? Well, little time, not little effort. All right, let's do it together. We're gonna shed body fat together. Every Monday, hit training with me, get fit on purpose. Let's do it.